the beaver here. Sad day for Blue Jay fans. And I just want to give my opinion. I never missed one game all year. I'm 61 years old. Huge fan. And uh, I'm going to start off with Vlad. Vladimir Guerrero. Clutch moment in the game. Bobby Shett is at bat. The base is loaded. And Vlad decides to slow down the game. Slow down, Bo. Slow down. He's not paying attention of what's going on, of where he's standing. And he gets picked off. It was a set play, and he got picked off. And you look at Bo Bichette standing there with the bat. That is minor league baseball. And Brandon Belt, one for seven, or one for eight. Strikeout after strikeout. Uh, then there's David Schneider, the guy that we wouldn't be there if it wasn't for Schneider. They swept the Red Sox. Schneider got six home runs or something, and he's an exciting player. He was a bit cold the last three or four games of the regular season, but that's the type of guy you want in there to draw the blood, to get the blood going. Schneider sat there on the bench with a smile on his face. Um, and, and then Springer was just okay. Um, and you look at Bobby Shett. He had some clutch hits. He didn't perform. Vlad, the pop-up after pop-up, just pop, 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 pop. And they could have won this series easily. Uh, and then there's the first game. You look at Bassett. He was hot. He wanted to pitch so badly. At the end of the game, of the second game, he sat on the, the sidelines with his hat down, his hoodie down, and just sad. He wanted to play. The guy is Blue Jays. He's blue and white. But they go with Gozman. And they had his number. They had his number. And they hit him. And no Bassett. I love Chris Bassett. And your pitchers are basically like goalies. If you have really good pitchers, you're going to win the game. The Maple Leafs need a good goalie, of course. And then there was Kirk. I don't blame much on Kirk. He was alone out there. And those injuries, he had to play a lot. He got some clutch hits, but he's slow on base. But he wants he wants to play good. You know what I mean? Romano, every time he comes up, it's like stepping on eggshells. Every time, all season. Sure, he got uh, loads of saves, but... It's, it's always just first and second, third, loaded bases, and he scrapes out of it. Eggshell season when he's up there. And <clears throat> Schneider. <coughs> Bad decisions, man. Bad decisions. All the time. And uh, you blame it on the analytics department. I don't know if I said that right in French, but you blame it on that. But the bottom line is you got to feel the game. You got to watch the game and you got to make the decisions from your feel. Schneider's not doing that. They're telling him what to do. He's, he's basically a puppet. Anyways, I feel for all the fans out there. Me and uh, Mrs. Beaver were so excited. They made the playoffs. And one more thing. They lost four in a row. They relied on other teams to lose, other teams to win. That's how they got in. So the last two games they lost against Tampa. And uh, you can't get a positive feel that way. And then you lost another two. That's four st straight losses at the end. Anyways, the way I see it, there's got to be some changes. This Vlad and Bobby Shett aren't the nucleus of the team. It needs to be a full team. I didn't feel that. It wasn't a full team. Vlad's throwing 
the Gatorade on every player. Last year it was the home run vest, then the Gatorade, and stopped at antics, play ball, play to win, play like a team, and have fun. I'm the Beaver, out.